apparently she and my dad were walking down the street and happened to glance in a perfectly open dumpster and discovered that, that somebody had thrown away what appeared to be perfectly good, possibly Gishwa's chocolates. And so, so that's, that's uh, what they pulled out of the dumpster. And I assume they're eating them. And they sent the first, there's a couple of photos of him in the dumpster. And then I responded with a lengthy period of silence on the text thread. Like, really? <laughs> and then they responded with a photo of the pile of chocolates, which was followed by another silence from me. And then they said, those were the ones that didn't touch the bottom of the dumpster. <laughs> like, don't worry, it's not that gross. They didn't touch it. Who, and who amongst us would, would have done the same if they saw a bunch of chocolate in the dumpster? <laughs> <laughs> when I was a kid, we used to go um, shopping. We didn't have a lot of, we had zero money. And um, so my mom would often go shopping at a place called Mix and Match in Greenfield. Uh, this is where you got really bargain basement, really cheap food. Uh, because it was the food that grocery stores couldn't sell. And at that time, the, they could legally resell it. Mix and Match is out of business now because it is no longer legal to do what they did. Because it was dented cans, like canned food that had been dented and presumably was infested with botulism, or uh, out of date things like expires, best if used by, etc. I would always have like little snacks at school and they would say on them, best if used by a time before you were born. Like, <laughs> they were so far out of date, it was unbelievable. And it was all, it always, this kind of harkens back to my earlier theme. Uh, every time you opened it, it was like, is there going to be something living inside? <laughs> Will it be crawling with mealworms? Um, which made it fun. It was like, yeah, kind of a, a, a ecological pinata every time. <laughs> but I digress, as usual. Um, I'm sorry for that tangent. It will never happen again. <laughs>